Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams again, and I'm here today with pool noodles, sample means, and Excel. All right, so the question at hand is, we have the pool noodles that are manufactured in a factory in China, and the length of the noodles is expected to be normally distributed with a mean of 5.2 feet. The standard deviation is 0 0.08 feet. And we take a random sample of 20 noodles. So what's the probability that a sample will have a mean of less than 5.14 feet? So the first thing that we want to do is to check the box that the central limit theorem applies. I only have a sample of 20 noodles, but that's okay because I have normal distribution. And that means that the criteria for central limit theorem is met. So when I go to do this problem in Excel, Excel is going to ask me for a value of the mean. It's going to ask me for a value of x, and it's then going to ask me for a standard deviation. So I'm going to do a little substituting because I'm doing central limit theorem here, and I'm going to let the mean become the mean of x bar which I know is 5.2 feet. Instead of x, I'm going to substitute in x bar. We want to know it's the probability that the sample mean will be less than 5.14 feet. And for the standard deviation, I'm going to use the standard error of the mean, which I'm going to find by taking the population standard deviation, dividing it by the square root of my sample size of 20. And when I do that math, that's going to give me rounded off 0 0.01789. So these are the three pieces of information that I need in order to work this question in Excel. So let's just sketch this out real quick so that we're absolutely sure of what we're solving for. So I know that the mean of x bar, which is the mean of the sample mean, is this 5.2 feet. I know that my x bar value here is equal to 5.14 feet, and I want the probability of less, a sample mean of less than 5.14. So I'm going to solve for this little area of the curve over here to the left of the mean. So let's jump over to Excel and make this happen. All right, so I'm over here in Excel and I'm going to double click on this little F of X right here where it says insert function and it's gonna give me my um, function list. Right? And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sort search for normal distribution. So I'm just going to search normal and say go. And down here on this list, what I want is I want the normal distribution, N-O-R-M dot D-I-S-T. I'm going to say OK. And it's going to give me a box where I can enter my quote unquote function arguments. Remember I said that X was actually going to be X bar. So that was my 5.14. I said I was going to let the mean of the sample mean be the mean of the distribution of 5.2. I also said I was going to use the um, standard error of the mean or the standard deviation of x bar to stand in for the standard deviation. And I think I use that as 0 0.01789. And last but not least, it wants me to, wants me to tell it, do you want this to be cumulative? Since we're solving for an area under the curve in a continuous distribution, we are going to tell them, yes, that is true. What you can see is that it's giving you the answer, the formula results um, in this function argument box. But if you click OK, it'll just dump that number for you into a cell, which is really helpful if you have other things to do with it. So let's go back and look at our curve and see what 
this looks like. So here we are back at our curve. We knew that what we were solving for was this small area here, or the probability that our sample mean, right, our sample would have a mean of less than 5.14 feet. And when we looked in Excel, it told us it was 0 0.0000. .00 three, nine, nine, which I would have rounded to 0 0.0004. If you need your answer expressed as a percentage, remember just move over two decimal places and you would end up with 0.04%. Or let's face it, a very small probability that your pool noodle is going to be shorter than 5.14 feet. I hope this helps. Check me out on YouTube for other videos on all things statistics. I hope you have a great day.